Queen by Oswald Boiseni Mchare. Oswald Boiseni Mchare from South Africa. Look how the boy is swinging on a swing. Dear listeners, welcome to the analysis of a poem, Boy on a Swing, that was written by Oswald Boiseni Mchare. Here is the poem. Slowly he moves, to and fro, to and fro. Then faster and faster, he swishes up and down. His blue shirt blows in the breeze like a tattered kettle. The world whirls by, east becomes west, north turns to south. The four cardinal points meet in his head. Mother, where did I come from? When will I wear long trousers? Why was my father jailed? Okay, so that's the poem, Boy on a Swing. Structure of the poem. The poem has four stanzas. The first stanza has four verses. The second stanza has three verses. Third stanza has four verses. And the fourth stanza has four verses. So the poem is made up of 15 verses or lines. The first stanza shows a boy having a swing. At this stage, the boy is having funny because he is still young and unconscious or unaware of what is going on in South Africa, even if there is uh, apathy apartheid system. The second stanza shows the boys, I mean how the boy's swinging increases and the image of his shirt is blowed. His shirt is blue but compared to a tattered kete which means that the boy was very poor. The third stanza shows how four cardinal points meet in the boy's head. Different cardinal points interchange positions. This shows how the boy begins to see things in different perspectives. He is now aware or conscious of what is going on in South Africa during the period of apartheid system. The fourth stanza contains three poignant questions the boy asked his mother. The first question, questions about his identity or the identity of blacks in South Africa. The question was, where did I come from? The second question asked is when the boy asks his mother, about when their economic status will be good. The boy says, when will I wear long trousers? And the last question asked by the boy is, why was his father jailed? And this shows how injustices or injustice prevailed in South Africa during the period of uh, apartheid system. Dear listeners, let us look at title of the poem. The title is Boy on a Swing. It may symbolizes the experiences that the boy went through in his lifetime that ultimately led him questions, question his mother about different issues which seem to have difficult answers in his society. Type of the poem. This poem is narrative as it narrates about the life of a boy. Language used or diction. This poem uses Simple language, the language that is well understood. Besides, it uses figurative language, 
and or poetic language. What are figures of speech used in this poem? Different figures of speech have been used in this, po in this poem. The first figure of speech is repetition. We can see the words like to and fro are repeated several times in this poem. The word faster is used or repeated in this poem, faster and faster. Another figure of speech is simile. The leaves in the poem, the place where like a tattered kete, like a tattered kete. Here, uh, the boy's blue shirt is compared to a tattered kete, but with the use of conjunction like. Another figure of speech is immeasurely. Blue shirt is an image that appeals to sight. To and fro is an image that appeals to motion. Apart from imagery, there is also symbolism. Boy's movement, which is to and fro, symbolizes boy's life experience. Long trousers symbolizes good life and that is what the boy wanted to have. And the last is rhetorical questions. There are different rhetorical questions or questions asked just for rhetorical effects, not needing answers. Those questions are communicated in the last stanza when the boy asks the mother, where did I come from? This was rhetorical. When will I wear long trousers? This was rhetorical too. Why was my father jailed? And this is rhetorical. Dear listeners, Apart from the language used, there are different themes communicated in this poem. The first theme is experience of life or life experience. The poem is a symbol. Symbolically, it shows different life experiences the boy passed through. The boy went through stages of childhood and uh, innocence and the stages of life dilemmas where he questions things. A swing was only a symbol. Another theme is poverty. During apartheid system, black South Africans were very poor. The boy in this poem is shown to have worn a blue shirt that was like a tattered kete, and this indicated a kind of poverty that the boy and the mother had. The third theme is consciousness, our understanding. The boy's questions indicate the boy's consciousness, so that the boy uh, is now aware of what is going on in South Africa and therefore starts questioning different questions uh, to understand more. The boy says, when will I wear long trousers? He also ask, asks questions like, why was my father jailed? This was to show the level of understanding the boy had gone through. The last theme is injustice. As the boy asks the mother, why was my father jailed? This is a, a hint to show us how life in South Africa is a night or is a problem to, South, to black South Africans. People are jailed without any apparent reason.
that is why the boy asks, why was my father jailed? Ladies and gentlemen, dear listeners, this is the analysis of the poem Boy on a Swing. Now, before I quit, I have to leave you these two questions. The first question is, who is the persona? Who is the persona? And the second question is, what do you learn from this poem? Thank you very much for listening. Don't, sub, uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Ciao.